Well, you're, you're stumping me right now, so I didn't realize that. Um, but it, it doesn't seem like it's been that long ago that I was just uh, announced the coach, and you're right now, it's six years later. So um, we we really have a, a great group of girls that I'm really excited about. Um, I, I really like the, the direction, the passion they have. Um, sometimes maybe a little too nice, where I'd like them to get toughen up a little bit. Um, but there's, there's no doubt at, at this point, this sixth year of my career here, and I, I can say that this is from one to 16, this is the, uh, probably the kindest, the most respectful, um, the most uh, sisterhood that I've ever seen in any team. And it's pretty cool. I did. I kind of set a goal in my head to get 10 player of the weeks, um, but I didn't because um, I kind of, I guess I had two bad games. So, I mean, that's not a big thing, but um, getting two player of the weeks was a, I mean, it was a big accomplishment for me. Like I look on the internet and I'll just be looking, I'm like, oh my goodness, really? But it was, it was, it was great to know that I was national player of the week two times. I was actually surprised. I mean, this year, honestly, was my plan was to give it my all and just go out there and do what I can. Because last year, I was really shocked by not getting the player of the year. So this year, like I said, I just wanted to come out and give it my all. And when I got that one, the first one, and then the, they just kept piling up. I mean, I was shocked, but then again, I was, I was excited. I mean, I felt like I earned it because I played my butt off this year. You know, I, I never got into uh, coaching for any kind of awards and any time, um, you know, in basketball there's, there's an award, it's a team, it's an, a team award, but, you know, just the fact that, um, you know, I've been able to uh, do what I love to do and that's work with young people is, is rewarding in itself. Uh, but Wayne Stace has had some outstanding coaches, so I take great pride in that. And, you know, Ron Hammy and Charlie Parker and those guys, uh, used to coach me at Bowling Green, so there's some tradition there, and uh, certainly those guys were great mentors and role models for me. I do. I actually just wore my ring the last game. I was showing them all. I was like, you know, if you guys work hard, this is what you can get. Uh, I have two. I only wore one. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I, I tell the guys every day, you know, if I could have one more chance to play, I would do it. So I try to tell them to give it everything they have, get everything they can out of the chance, the opportunity to play here. And, you know, just take the best from it. Don't, don't take it for granted because there's people out there that really want to be in their position.